Proving Jesus is God from the Jehovah's Witness Bible Part 3. Take them to Jeremiah 17 verse 10. Have them read it slowly. Make sure they comprehend it. It says, I Jehovah, I Jehovah am searching the heart, examining the innermost thoughts to give to each one according to his ways, according to the fruitage of his works. Now we're going to pass over the word fruitage. <laughs> Make sure they realize that it is Jehovah that is the one that is searching the hearts, examining their most thoughts. He's the one that gives each one according to his ways, right? According to the, fr the fruitage <laughs> of his works. Great. Okay, now bring them to Revelation 2, 18 through 21. It says, To the angel of the congregation in Thyatira, write, These are the things that the Son of God says. Stop them there. Make sure they comprehend. Who is saying this? It says the Son of God is saying this, correct? These are the things that the Son of God says, the one who has eyes like a fiery flame and whose feet are like fine copper. Quote, I know your deeds and your love and faith and ministry and endurance and that your deeds of late are more than those you did at first. If you try to teach them, they're going to run away from you. They're trained to run away from you if you try to teach them. So you just want to ask them questions. Hey, help me understand. Jehovah in Jeremiah 17 is the one who searches the heart knows the innermost thoughts, gives to each one according to his ways, according to the fruitage of his works, right? And it clearly says in Revelation 2, the Son of God says that he is the one who knows everyone's deeds and their love and faith and ministry and endurance. How do you know somebody's love and faith if you don't know their thoughts, if you don't know everything about them? And again, to give each one to the fruitage of his works. And you have to understand too, if you've seen the previous videos, this is after we've already shown them the Father judges no one, Jesus does all the judgment, Jesus is the one who repays according to everyone's deeds, and Jesus also calls himself the Alpha and the Omega, beginning and the end. So go back to those videos check that out because this is this is building i jehovah am searching the heart examining the innermost thoughts to give to each one according to his ways according to the fruitage of his works